laws of power. Law number two. Never put too much trust in friends. Learn how to use it. Mr. Green! We'll put a little disagreement in here. All right, bro. A little disagreement. Over time, friends are gonna be consistent. I think this is talking about the short-term friend. I think Mr. Green is extending the leap of friendship a little bit further than I am. If you're that person that has tons of friends, and I mean tons, this might apply to you. If you are a bro or a broette of my own heart, guess what? You ain't got that many. Mr. Green, Mr. Green's afraid that your friends are gonna become envious. But guess what? In the wolf pack, we ain't calling those friends, are we? Y'all put on hater blockers, all right? Don't let your friends get too comfortable. Don't let them get spoiled, because then you aren't the real friend. Now, sometimes we let our friends control us, but once again, ask yourself, is that a real friend? All right, Mr. Green's gonna say hire an enemy here. I kinda agree. Go ahead and reach out. Look, if you've been someone's competitor, you know that person. You know what they're willing to do to W, all right? I think that means a whole lot more than either your yes man or that person that's really just your friend because it's advantageous. All right, you may have more to fear from friends than enemies. What? What? All right, look. You're probably sharing those dirty, dark secrets with those friends. But then who's gonna have the leverage? If you have no enemies, what are you doing in life? Go make some. Those are the ones who are truly gonna push you and help you grow. Because remember, if you're staying comfortable, you ain't growing.